guys thank you so much for joining me thank you for watching my past videos and thank you for joining me for this video which is all about my first week in Ghana my thoughts the places I went to the foods I ate everything like that so stay tuned and let me know what you think if you have any recommendations for future videos always post them down below and like I said I'm not based in Accra I'm based in Takrady Western Region I've got my little nephew here Western Region and I'm trying my best to record <laughs> with my family around watch the end of the video to see the little interview I did with them hey Afri hey and the cheekiness of his face, I'm telling you. Okay, so I'm all done. Okay. Let's get into the video. <laughs> One break. Okay. So this is Amarina. And this is Nathaniel. <laughs> My intro is finally done. It took me so long, about 15 minutes to get it done, but it's done. Let's get into the video. Look at the little chicks. They're not used to humans coming around them, so they're running away. <laughs> Their parents are over there somewhere. This is them, the South Kitchen. And this is the mango tree. Look, we've got a mango tree in our yard. There's some mangoes on there. They're not ripe though, so best believe when they get some riper, I'm gonna be here. And this tree as well. Mammy, put your them a ye. What friend are they? Debo. 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 Okay, they call it Debo. Oh, yeah, but I sell supper. Neza. It's Numun. Okay. That's my nan. Mammy. Much of Frank a cry. And then pay. Hey, I want fair. Beautiful. I want fair. Rucho, I want fair. I want fair. Just following the chick. Look at this. Attacking. Attacking the children. These are not ours, I don't believe. Ours are downstairs. Well, I don't, I don't even think we have any. But these are the neighbors. Akoko. There's a cockerel as well. There's some land there that I want to practice growing, etc, etc, etc. Like I'll show you the mango tree and all these mangoes. And I came here to Debal. That's where we start. So this is Debal. It's going to get massive and we're going to harvest it. There's some coconuts as well. This is all on our land. It's so good. I love it here. And you can't, you can't go this way, but you get lost. I mean, these slippers, it's just not going to work. So I'm just going to go here slightly and show you. My grandma planted all these coconuts. There's another mango tree there at the back. Oh my goodness, look at this land. I'm going to practice a little bit of permaculture. I'm just going to transform it bit by bit. I just can't wait to experiment with everything. Look at the hawk or falcon, whatever it is. But gosh, I feel so cool. There's some more coconuts on this side. There's some more land, there's plantain. I'll show you the banana tree actually. Let me go. Mother one P day. I don't know. And here we are, we have some banana trees, we've got some more chickens, we've got some more chickens over there. This is not our land, this is someone else's land. And people are building actually. So they have built onto the land, this is what it looks like here, they've built onto the land. But it's their land so they can do whatever they want with it and here you can see the view absolutely gorgeous so we're in Takradi I feel so good honestly I feel so so good 
Father's love. Look. No, yeah, yeah. My granddaddy built this house for my grandma and obviously all his children. And look, there's Father's love there. I think that's incredible. I love that. Look at that fresh air. Yes, yes. Ify, ify. Got for food, we got for food, and ah, and car crud dead, so and my for food, yes, and to pay in need to ban. Hey, ain't you no Vivia? Ain't you no Vivia? The GRA, we're going to get our Ghana cards made. Let's go in. Hello, guys. So, we're still in Takradi. We went to the GRA to just sort out the Ghana card. It's going to take a few days, so we're going to wait for that. In the meantime, we're actually just behind the post office in Takradi. We're trying to get an affidavit done as well. So just in some kind of lungum, some corner corners and we're just getting everything sorted oh, it's such a beautiful day look at the sun on my skin mm. it feels so good <laughs> but i'm in the shade of course because i'm trying to protect myself trying to cool down and it just feels absolutely incredible honestly i am so blessed and just so honored to be able to experience my city my country at this age because I'm so much more aware, more conscious of the things I want in life and what I want to achieve from being here. So I'm very happy, I'm very happy, I feel so joyous, I mean the whole morning has been blessed, I've been speaking to so many people and the banter has just been incredible. Mm -hmm. There's a certain way you banter in fancy, that you cannot banter in English and it's always a simple matter. I did a church no need simple matter so i've been bantering it's been so fun this is the outfit for today it's my outfit oh man so i've got my blue on today blue and gold a bit of silver here and there i've got my blue hair on as well you know it and i've got my black shoes on today because as you can tell my feet are a little bit swollen these are my feet they're a little bit swollen they've actually gone down but you can see how puffy they are how cute <laughs> so cute so this is what happens when you travel not everyone gets this of course but they look so cute very chubby <laughs> can you see it probably there we go yeah so just wearing some slippers, feeling cool, allowing myself to cool down, and yeah, still enjoying life. Hi, I found some more cats, guys. They're so cute, they're all really small. That one at the back there is so beautiful, the green eyes. They both have green eyes, look. 
Wait, if you don't high alerts, they but the ears just went up. The ears just went up. Thank you. Eh, that's see. Mm -hmm. What's your emblem? Ah, uh, emblem crap. Made a bad show. Maybe I made a bad show. Emblem crap. <laughs> Show you what friend of Danny Bill, I'm very free. Must on a monum, necessary Hey guys, hey hey, so it's officially my third week in Ghana and I'm able to sit outside and just feel cool and beautiful and not be sweating like mad. The first week that I've just shown you in the video, that's exactly how I felt. I felt beautiful, I felt cool, but it was very hot, very very hot. To the point where I'd go out with it's called pure water, you know, the sachets of water like this. We would freeze them and I'd wrap it around my face towel and I'll use that to cool me down on my days out. However, now I can sit outside in the cool breeze and just feel cool and not feel like I'm melting, <laughs> which is a first. So the first week was all about getting some documentation sorted as you just saw. At first we had to get our Ghana card which was absolutely pivotal for everything else to even begin. And the Ghana card is basically your ID, your identity card. It just shows that yes you are Ghanaian, this is where you live, this is when you were born, this is where you were born. And one thing I found out as well is that hometown and ah! <laughs> oh, it's so windy that my tripod is just <laughs> okay it's steady now <laughs> one thing i found out is that hometown and birth town or place of birth rather a difference what is that so hometown is basically where your family comes from and place of birth is where you were born so that is the difference I never knew that and yeah now I know so yeah that was the whole experience the guys there were so funny we had a blast we all talked it was just a very fun and easy process and they also <laughs> took my biometrics as well I'm gonna have to hold my tripod a bit so they also took my biometrics so they scanned my eyes there's a picture of my face my thumbprints my fingerprints and they produced my Ghana card for me. It took a few days because the day that we went, the printer was broken. So they could, they had to delay it by a few days, which for me is fine. <sighs> that week, that week was such a glorious week. I adapted very easily because I'm in Ghana. I lived here when I was young. And a lot of people think, ah, but you left when you were a child. How can you remember or how can you love it so much? And the reason being is that it's where I was born, it's where I grew up, you know, my cousins, my family, my grandma, this was my life. So I have very fond memories of it still to this day. In fact, the majority of my childhood, what I remember comes from Ghana as opposed to the UK. And I just love the lifestyle, you know, being able to sit outside on your piece of land with the wind blowing <laughs> and the trees you know I've got palm nut trees I've got coconut trees growing from the ground I've got plantain banana you know sweet apple trees I've got mango trees around me I've got breadfruit trees around me <clears throat> what 
What more could you ask for? I've got goats frolicking, chickens frolicking. <sighs> this is a lie, honestly. And in fact, I had great plans to come to Ghana and do some permaculture homesteading on the piece of land that my mum and I own. And because of the situation, like where the land is situated, I can't access it that easily so I'm not even able to do all the different you know building with the cob house and all those things that I had planned which is such a shame however because we have this piece of land I asked my grandma and she said that some of my uncles will help me weed it and then I can get started here so that's what I'm going to do I've got so many so many plans for Ghana and yes, this is my third week and yes, I'm taking it slow because I love slow living. I love just taking my time and traveling. I love just doing everything at a good enough pace. I love it all. So I'm just taking my time and sure scares me. I want to announce it for the Oh no, it's all done. Me video now. I'm just talking to my niece. She's got her skirt, so she brought me back my bag. She actually took my bag to church. Look at, ah! <laughs> Bro, look at her little eh? This is Anna Marina. <laughs> this is my niece. Yo, Jnaha. Let me your video name It's really hot, so I just want to get the video done and go sit in the cool with her. But now it's Bray. Ow. She used to stab me, oh, this girl. Wow, wow my papa. More trinity to the left. I'll beat her left bum cheek. Crap. This is my nephew as well. You know the girl that you saw in my first video? So this is Nat. Nat, okay, hello. Hello. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> oh. You know the girl you saw in my first video, Noki, my niece? So this is my niece's son. His name is Nat. So yeah, I'm just chilling at home and this is what I love, you know, being surrounded by family, such a beautiful day and we're just relaxing. After this, we're going to sit inside. Hey. Hey. She's Mom, playing around with the camera. Uh -huh, I won't go. Or she may even see. So I'm just going to go back inside and add this ending to my video. It's supposed to be an ending. So I'm going to add this to my video and just edit it in and then just spend some time with my family go and help my aunt cook as well do all of that good stuff love you guys guys stay blessed and i'll see you next week Bye. hey guys hey nathaniel Cafe. hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in Today's video, I'm going to be. It's all one one pin in my video, yeah. Eh? No. Hey. Hey. We're going to make pin, no? No, we're going to make pin, no. What's your soul? What's your soul? Oh, hey, what's that country? Oh, that country. Oh, I'm going to Oh, but that's see. Oh, I'm a mkwe. I thought that, I thought that, I thought that. Hey, I just want to tell you a quick look at the museum, though. I thought that. 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 Guys, welcome to my video. I'll show you my niece and nephew at the end of the video. But I'm just eating some tiger nut. Not mkwe. I'm just about to show them down, Mobian. Oh, mkwe, mkwe, mkwe. I'm really about to finish now. <laughs> He's giving me loads, but this is a tiger nut. Huh? Oh. I I do. Ah! I'm 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 Then my marine. Mm. <laughs> my, mm. my niece took the oil and put it in her mouth. Guys, welcome to my video. 
welcome to my video so this video i'm just going to show you oh let me finish what's in my mouth my house is calling me so i gotta go hey guys welcome to hey guys welcome to my channel i hope you're all watching one day or me and me audio let me video records in are you hearing them guys? I'll show you them at the end of the video. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Jake, 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 Jake. Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for coming to my video. Nats, I'm Rina in Katsawana. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, I'm in Katsawana. I'm in Katsawana. I'm in Katsawana. Jake, Jake, I'm in Katsawana. Uh-huh, I'm in Katsawana. Uh-huh, I'm in Katsawana. I'm in Katsawana. Not a kiss of beer or a cuts no one on. A kiss of beer cuts no one on. This is my mom. See my fur, my thoughts. This is my hip. See my grandma's mother. I shriek. Please try again. Eh? I am know you. I don't know you, please. Keep quiet by early floods. No. I not know you. Lord. No.